Hi you guys. How is everybody? Oh, and then there's Cass. You just take him home. Along I'd with love Thor. To. It's a two for one deal. Hi guys. Hey. <clears throat> okay, how's it here? Jump. Oh have no. Seat. no, no, no. It's always fun to have a buddy. Have a seat. Okay. Really sitting here so, in front of the camera. Oh, it's just nice to hit talk with a buddy instead of talking by myself to a wall. Hi well, guys. You're not. You've got 500 and some odd people watching us. Oh really? How many people are watching us? 500, 600, 700. Five million. One more. Oh. <gasps> now Denise is here too. 501. <laughs> <laughs> Jackie's back there watching. 502. 466. 466. Okay. Oh, 469. Oh, it's gaining. It's gaining speed. Yes. If I shut this door and that door, can I finish sweeping out here without it bothering me? I think so. Yeah. Yeah. I think it'd be okay. Okay, guys. Oh, although we are doing a Jimmy update. We're updating about Jimmy. So we might want to. Um, yeah, I was going to say you might want to catch us okay guys so we are here uh giving an update with jimmy and lynette's not here um <laughs> slacker took off of work and uh uh took jimmy to a doctor's appointment and they're watching right now so yeah. hi guys hi um <laughs> so okay so we're going to give you a little update of what the heck is going on with jimmy and a lot of it's uh unknown at this point but um and jimmy has giving me permission to talk about a lot of this with you guys so I'll just go ahead and uh, start there um, if you guys don't know Lynette is the my assistant director here she is wonderful and Jimmy is her husband and uh, Jimmy's fought for quite a long time now with cancer uh, just man, just has fought and fought and fought with this um, we had a lot of good news with it over the years of it going away um, I think it was approximately over the summer um, they start he started having they started finding some more issues going on um, and I believe and I'm probably gonna say this wrong because they're not here so bear with me if I my, my memory's wrong but approximately over the summer I believe it was uh, they found some spots on his liver there's Jimmy um, praying for you Jimmy we're thinking about you Jimmy so this is all for prayers for Jimmy um, they found some spots on his liver the, unfortunately nothing could really be done about it um, as far as surgically I think because it was on all spots of the liver so um, fast forward to Christmas time Jimmy started experiencing just a just an awful awful lot of pain lots of pain um, most of the time that well I think pretty much the whole time that they were off on vacation incidentally they were in the ER almost I think just about every night with Jimmy um, just experiencing pain going up uh, to Michigan to his specialists up there his cancer doctors and and just really struggling they couldn't find out what was going on and it turns out that um, it looks like he has got a, um, a four four inch by five inch tumor on his uh, liver um, that it seems like it might be wrapping up around some nerves and mm. causing just just a, an unbelievable amount of pain. He is on just more pain meds than you've ever even heard of. Um, so they've been kind of biding their time um, while uh, they can get into their specialist, which is going to be Thursday to actually see them and get some real solid answers. He's they he's gone through so many tests and scan, scans and and all of this stuff, but um but he's been in and out of the ER um most nights because of the pain. Um last night he was back in the ER. Um he was bleeding a lot, I guess. Um in unspeakable places. <laughs> um and uh so that's not good so um they were able to get an appointment with their regular doctor here in napoleon and i guess their doctor i just got off the phone with them their doctor in napoleon was like you're going to michigan so they are right now scrambling and running up to michigan 
and um, an excellent hospital by the way it is a it's a very good hospital and and they're gonna go in there and they are just gonna get some answers so they are really really asking for anybody to think of prayers and good thoughts and everything that they can get a handle on what's going on here and just get him get him squared away because this has just been a relentless um, barrage that he's been having to go under and, and of course Lynette too you know because that's stressful watching stressful someone you family, love yep. hurting and you can't do anything about it and so so that's our updates I'm not quite sure when we're gonna see uh, Lynette you know we, we are expecting some snow I think over the next couple days so I don't know if that's gonna trap her and well them up in Michigan or, or what's gonna happen their animals are being cared for so that's good news there <laughs> but um, so they said the good news is they're going up and they're going to get some darn answers. <laughs> so, um, yeah. So yeah, that's where we need. That's to be. where that's where we're at. I'm just really hoping. Um, you know, I think I think just the best thing Jimmy's asking for is prayers. Would be just just nonstop. Just keep hitting it hard with some prayers and good thoughts and all that things. Um, so yeah, it's just. Uh, you know, I think mostly if, you know, I just feel like I'm just praying for his comfort and um, that his mind is at ease, his body's at ease. And um, knowledgeable that doctors. He has knowledgeable doctors and comfort for Lynette too because this is just very stressful. Um, <coughs> you know, so because we sure love them. And so that's our, that's our update. It's, uh, we love you both. Safe. Yeah. Yes. Yes. I I have a feeling Lynette's um <laughs> Lynette is um you know gonna hound dog them until they get some sort of answers. I mean this has just been going on for weeks and weeks and weeks with this terrible terrible pain. So um it man. Yeah. Sometimes you just have to put your foot down and say. We've got to do something. Yeah, you they know. just need they need some sort of just give them some sort of answer on something, anything, just just answer something. So, um, yeah. So, here's hoping. I, you know, I, I'm assuming they're gonna. I'm sure they're gonna keep me updated. And uh, it sounds like they want me to share the updates when they get them. So I will let you guys know as soon as we hear anything. I'm really just boy, I would just love some some answers and stuff today and just take just, care of you too if we need to we'll take care of your animals yeah um, and we'll take care of it here so you've got you've got time we've got this covered we've got your animals covered just um, take care of yourselves yeah yeah we're, we're we're thinking of you guys so Who is that little one that was chewing on my earring? That is Gideon. Oh, yeah, he's back again. <laughs> um, yeah, so so that's what we're we're thinking. And um, can you take a chew and put him in a, a pin? Um, <clears throat> in a pen. Oh yeah. Um, and uh, yeah, so just. You know, no, um, go to, put them in front numbers. I'll have them check. Um, please, thank you. Um, so yeah, so gosh, just keep your keep your thoughts out for them, and uh, and Lynette too, and just hope that we can get this figured out and some sort of answers going on. So yeah. I'm really hoping that we get some sort of yeah answers. I mean, at this point now, that's yeah. what we need. Is yeah, some answers. Yeah, so preferably good ones. Yeah, so that's our updates. Uh, you know, we'll keep you updated um, as time goes on, and and hopefully we get some good good answers along the way and uh we'll we'll keep you updated so how's barb um barb's doing okay she is uh still um she's still in the 
getting what's that called recovery Re um therapy therapy physical therapy she, she's still in therapy and um we're watching her and checking her cats and all that stuff her sister's coming into town to to be with her so that's really great um yeah so here's hoping <coughs> yeah he's a chomper so Seriously. there's that. that that's our nice. that's our updates. We'll let you know. Gosh, nice. as soon as we nope. he's okay. Get uh, get some more. So all right, thanks guys. Thanks for the good wishes and the prayers and keep your spirits up, Jimmy. Yep, we're thinking about you guys. So love ya, and we'll be seeing you guys soon. All right, and I'm gonna put this little hi. What's your chat name? Jimmy. It's yeah. Jimmy, Jimmy Green. Right here. James. James Green, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, that is his name, isn't it? Yep, it is. So. Hi, Jimmy. What? It's going to say something smart. Chicken butt. Hi, Mike. Hi, Mike. It's going to be something smart. Now he's gonna. Now he's gonna make me wait. What doing? What doing? What doing? Cause why? Chicken thigh. <laughs> Jeez. I've never this heard that one. Chicken thigh. Guess what? Chicken thigh. Ch oh, that one I've heard. Guess I've, why? I've never heard that chicken one. Chicken thigh. I'm gonna do that. You'll really? use that one on my nephew. Cause he does. Really? He does. Guess what? Chicken butt all the time. Well, there's a second part to that. Guess what? Chicken butt. Guess why? Chicken thigh. Why do you think Meowdeth? Meowdeth is like, I sleepy. I sleepy. Almost time for them to get their stitches out. Yep, we're it? getting close. What'd they say? Uh, it's a, it always ranges. It's like 7 to 10 days, 10 to 14, maybe 12. So, well, you all right. Good. All right. Well, we'll be thinking about you guys. We're going to go get back to work. Get back to work since we're... Having good. to pick up the slack. Hi, Mousy. Hi, Mouse. We'll pick all right. up all the slack we need to. Yep. And it says she'll work that much harder. Yes, be careful driving. <laughs> yes, please. Get there safe. Okay, be careful, guys. All we right. love you. Bye, I love y'all.